Hello, I'm Ernst. In this video, I want to show you how easy it is to configure the display to your needs with the smart grid concept of the RTO oscilloscope. To do this, I have an RTO here and three waveforms plus a math channel that are at the moment only activated in one single grid. So you see, it's ugly. You cannot really analyze the waveforms at the moment. But what you see on the side here is what we call signal bar, where you see all the de detail information of the signal itself. So the vertical scaling, you see the bandwidth of the signal and the coupling. How do you simply change the display configuration of the scope? That's done very easy. Just grab one signal from the signal bar and decide where you want to put it. So you see, I move it around and I decide now I want to move it to the bottom and that's it. You can do the same with the third waveform, but I now want to have a split screen on the bottom so that I see those two waveforms and the third one I move in between. So now you have a very flexible grid. You can even change the size of the grid by just tapping and moving. What else can you do? You can minimize the waveform when you just want to have an overview of the waveform. And it's always updated with every single acquisition. So you see when I do run a single acquisition, you see that waveform that's minimized is updated to the current configuration. So this shows you some possibilities that you have with the smart grid operation and how easy it is to configure the display to your needs with the RTO oscilloscope smart grid.